your left arm, you're sleeping with your arm dangling like this. Okay, left arm, so there it is. I've made some marks on it. I made an incision on the outer side of the arm. I'm using this little instrument to just spread the tissue and I'm about ready to go into the joint. Okay, it's done very gently, very slowly, just to make sure that we get into the joint. And then I put a little metal tube like this. And I slide it in very gently. Okay. And in a second, I'll be putting in my camera. See that's joint fluid that just came out? See that? That's joint fluid that just came out. That means that we are inside the joint. Okay, so that's a good sign. Put that away. And this is my camera, this is the arthroscope. It has a light that acts like a flashlight. It has water that gets pumped in. Then I slide the watch over there. So we monitor, we go inside, we're going into the tube, we go into the joint, and then once I'm in the joint, I open up the water, okay? We open up the water and we start looking. See, look at this, we're into the joint. We're actually in the joint now, looking inside, and I see a big spur right there. I'm gonna be looking at your joint. I'm gonna be shaving that down in a few minutes. Look down here, look what I'm doing here. See how I'm doing this, now look at the top. I'm going to kind of over there as I do this, see? See that right there? I'm going to remove that big uh, overgrown spur that you can see on the monitor. I'll be removing that, and then I'll be looking for some loose bodies like that one right there. We're going to be doing that. So I'm going to be doing some work right now. Uh, when I'm done, I'll, I'll do a little bit more video, and then I'll see you in the recovery room, okay? Bye, Lucas. A, a patient who has what I call cauliflower elbow of MMA, very different from the baseball player's elbow. This is the back of the elbow. This is the olecranol fossa. This is a olecranol spur at the tip of the olecranon rather than the medial side, which is what we see in baseball players over there. So Osteophyte, which is preventing the patient from fully extending their elbow. When they cannot extend their elbow, they lose distance and it puts them at a disadvantage when it comes to fighting. They lose their snap and they lose distance. So, so what we're going to be doing here is gently finding a little spot right here. You can already tell it's almost loose. Just tapping that right there. Separating that spur right there. See? Separating it. I'm using an osteotome in the back. You can look up here, so I'm sure you can see what's going on over here. There's an osteotome camera. I'm tapping, I'm tapping, I'm lifting. A little bit more tap. Staying, I'm staying away from the older side. So I'm gently aiming away from the older nerve. I want to go over there. Let me find the right spot right over here. Once again, elevating it, I'm tapping, there it goes. See, that's a, that's a normal electron tip over there. That was an overgrowth that was impinging on the electron fossa. What I'll be doing here is I'll be removing it on mass with a, with a grasper. So I have a grasping device and I will, I will, I will have to expand my portal to allow exit of this fragment. Be removing this and then I'll be clearing up the rest of this electron spur to help this patient with cauliflower elbow of a mixed martial artist and a patient that was not able to fully extend. Very different from the baseball player.
that's that olecranon tip or that spur that had drawn the olecranon tip. Can you see that? Okay. That was causing impingement of the back of the elbow. Thank you. Thank you.